Metaphor time, we just got done playing RE5. Let me change the title really quick. It's metaphor time. Just for... Shorter, though, going on right there. T uh, category. It makes me so happy when more and more people follow this category, guys. And it's like more and more people join the metaphor crew. Let's go. What did I... I had... Today I had... It's like a roasted vegetable sandwich thing. Um, my roomies got it for me for watching Doggo all week. It was good. I also have curry, which I made uh, on Wednesday, which I'll eat after stream. Yeah, well, let's play this for like two-ish hours, guys, and then we'll play for a long time tomorrow. Excited for it. We Or we left off. Oh, we left off, we're delivering the Dragon Lance. We left off, we're delivering the Dragon Lance. And we were gonna do that, but then we ended up going to like a festival going on. So... We weren't able to do that yet, because they were like, we can leave a day later, actually. So, a controller. It's controller time, guys, which is much better for my hand. Let's do it. Look at us. Look at the crew, guys. We love the crew. I'm gonna put my wrist brace. And I believe we have one more crew member that can join. There was one more chair left in the, um... in the ship. And been loving the general. As long as there's other people in the fight with us, and like we're not going in solo, been loving the general and commander, um, archetypes. I beg your pardon, but... Um, since we journeyed together for some time, I want to thank you for having me. I'm sad to leave my brother and I'll miss him dearly, but I know in my heart this will be a grand adventure. Well... I just have to get out of here without being attacked. Oh, yeah! It was so funny. The brothers were like, well, Fidelio was like, to Juno, like, are you planning on killing Luis? <laughs> and she's like, oh. Yes. I cannot have my stomach grumbling while afield. I should buy myself a small ration of something before we depart. It's the trouble is finding food that will not spoil. Is it nighttime? It is. Okay, we're going to sleep. <sighs> the brothers are okay. I don't think they know the particulars of our plan, but we can't let our guard down. I... When we first arrived, I never thought we'd make it to the journey. Make thought me making the journey to Altabury. Hope in our hearts. Let the wave waves rock us then. We will prepare ourselves for the trials to come. Good night. Pray for many odds. I appreciate you. If I ever get spoiled, people do get timed out. Time down. marches <laughs> on, and the age of a new Be king like, draws nearer. Nope. Killing Luis, yeah, but the brothers work for Luis. <laughs> and are keeping an eye on us. <laughs> I must say, I'm sad to leave the island for another reason that every meal here has been an utter delight. I'm most certain you said the same thing when we left Brylhaven and Martira. A new world of cuisine is a few days away. Mind your tongue. A few days is thrice as many meals. What? Wow, you're really taking this hard. Well, when you've said your goodbyes and people to own food, you get the gutler runner. Thank you, Nightbot. Reaffirming. Uh, hold on. Do I need to buy anything okay. for heading out? I think we're actually uh, absolutely then... fine. What now? Yeah, I think we're chilling. Hmm. We didn't have to fight anything. So we basically stocked up yesterday. Well, <laughs> Two days ago, because we thought that we'd be leaving yesterday, but we ended up going to the festival. That's the way. So I think we're fine. Hello there. You did yourself yesterday. The village has not had a banquet in quite some time, so we truly tried to make it special. Now I remember the last time I heard such raucous, raucous, raucous laughter from the island. What you've done is truly for us, truly priceless. And at Ria, we shall no longer be an island that rejects all outside influence. Instead, we will welcome travelers regardless of tribe. 
That's my vision for the island. I hope you'll come back soon and see how we're doing. Take care of Yufa. I got you, bro. That's the way. All very nice. But yeah, we're playing this all day tomorrow. So I'm excited Wait, for that. And I'm not sure what our schedule is for the next week. I'll try to actually do that after this stream so I can tell you guys. So we're streaming next week um, every day except for Tuesday. Oh yeah, I also need to play the Phasmo event because it's not go. It's it's over soon. Right. The Halloween event. I don't. Even, I think that event went on for like just straight just a week. Hmm. If I may. Who contains many people from different tribes? Yes, I'm impressed you're all able to work together. You. Yes, you count a famous songstress amongst you, but truly you're just as powerful as she, unique she is, as she is, well, colorful and unique as she is. There we go. Boy, that. I would say that we're better than Juna even. <laughs> I don't know. Looks like the sea settled somewhat. We've got a map of the Alterberry region too. I'd say we're set. Now we can leave with our minds clear and pockets full, eh? But where are those brothers? Out on errands? I say we just leave them behind. Uh, yeah, that seems like a bad idea. Well, long I as love we've got those a brothers. minute alone, let's go over our plan. As soon as we get to Alterbury, we give Luis the fake lance Nurus made up for us. While I hold on to the real one. So when Fidelia was in, like, emergency care, and I, we were trying out the lance, being like... Does it work past the king's protection? He somehow saw it. I feel like... <laughs> I feel like they could just be watching right now. Then, on the eve of this divine Highs relic dedication the entire ceremony, crew's great. we use the real lance to end this once and for all. He doesn't know we've worked out its powers. We'll use that to our advantage. Juna, we'll need you to convince Luis to attend the eve of the festival. Oh, I've been pestering him to do so for a while now. Don't want him spending the evening in his heavily fortified Skyrunner, after all. So where is the false lance in question? Right here, ready to poke an eye out. <laughs> oh, what do you think? Perfect. A dead ringer, eh? Such detail. Even I can't tell them apart. When we get to Alterbury, we'll pass off the fake to Luis. Then... We execute our plan. Oh, by the way, I was talking with the Magnus brothers earlier. I think they might be on to us. <sighs> That's not good. We'll need to be more careful. Wait, footsteps. Speak of the devils. We'll need to hide the real lance. You're late. We were about to leave you behind. <laughs> right. All present and counted. Anchors away, what? Aye, aye, me hearties. <laughs> We're pirates. Uh, what's wrong then? Is that not the customary exclamation of sailors? Mr. Batlin was very specific. I wouldn't believe everything he says. Tis a strange melancholy. Leaving the people we have so recently come to know. We'll be back. With some fantastic tales to tell them too. Yes. Certainly. Hmm. You're pirates, guys. Oh god! Oh! Oh! This is Alterberry Heights. God! We'll make faster progress back on land. A week later. Oh, it's snow! Oh, I love snow. I'm ready. I feel like it'll take a long time. It's gonna be like four days again. <sighs> Alsberry Heights is quite a, uh, quite a ways. I think we'll make it in time. Without a problem, this fine wind will have us making landfall by the morrow. The whole trip should be two nights and three days travel. Oh, three. Oh. oh. So, I'll only have to endure one day of being rocked sick. It's a grim face ever saw one. Captain, for stroll's sake, let's make haste. <laughs> Tell you, then. We'll speed the Alsberry Heights, Captain Mont. Mont Ontario, capital of Ontario. Um, take care. You don't tumble overboard. 
Honestly, if anyone in our crew should be called Gold Roger, it probably just think our character, With of the main character, tow, throwing money. The Gauntlet Runner at last departs the island toward the eastern side of the Inland Sea. Their destination Goldie Roger. is the Principality of Montario. Its vast mountain crags, so different from the western terrain, can be seen clearly from the water. Their forthcoming task would be their greatest trial yet. They felt the tension rise in wordless silence. A what trophy? I don't want to know about any trophies if I don't if like we don't have them already. Indeed. Two more days. Two more days. Not only is this journey what to do about any sea monsters. Where is Oh the money one? Let's go. Seriously. You realize there was probably a way to get the lance that didn't involve saving the Pagan Girl, yeah? I suppose I can't complain since you got the lance either way. Still, if you want Count Lisa's favor, take my advice to stop playing the hero. Oh yeah, it was one of the first achievements. We got that a really long time ago. Like a week ago? Over a week? A long time ago in the term of this game, like us playing this game. Oh, yeah, we can make the amber stew. All Let's good. do it. I'm sure, Yufa will teach you. Let's go get her. Actually, I discussed this with my brother before leaving the island, but it's not amazing how many different cuisines the world has to offer. My drink is filled with ingredients I've never seen before and filled with a variety of medicinal herbs. If we combine such herbs with my island specialties, I'm sure it'll make a wonderful dish. Start preparing the food with the Yufa. May I? The herbs are bitter, but mixing them better with more them mixing them better makes them more palatable. Do be careful with this one though, it's extremely bitter. I simmer them for a bit, this is where things truly take shape. <laughs> An incantation to make it tastier. The stew we made was intense. What this is? Stammer stew one bite and you feel the power up inside you. Is this cooking? I cooked without passing time. Um, where's Basilio? I want to talk to both the bros before they be leaving us. So I don't think they're gonna stay on our side. Or they will, I don't know. It's hot out though, right? We can't go outside? Oh, we can. I have no idea where that man is. <laughs> we can go fishing and we should. Bro has teleported so he, he does not exist on the ship right now. Alright, so I have yes. all the supporters. I just want to look, bro. What now? Juno's two, Yufa's three, so we should hang out Juno for Yufa. Oh, I sneezed. I'm so sorry. And Juno! Oh, you don't want to hang out. Oh, hi. You. I didn't answer you. Can't believe you actually got the relic off them. Couldn't afford to, uh... <laughs> I know, but... <laughs> oh, no. Couldn't afford to, uh... Have up a job from Lord Luis, though, could you? Otherwise, you'd be dead. Wait. Thank goodness for a fitting for all to that sweltering heat. The islandist people are absolutely lovely, though. Thailand's deal. How do they deal with such a heat? Although I suppose hair like mine only amplifies the problem. Um, a scroll we have maxed. How are our stats doing? 
I wish Juna did want to hang out because she boosts our eloquence. Heisman, you want to hang out? You do tolerance. Tolerance, Heisman. Bro, I can't fight anyone in my crew this all the time. <laughs> Sure, the Ella. Hi, Spam. Um, I'll just go fishing. It won't be hanging out with Heisme, but like it is still hanging out with Heisme. Oh, jeez. This is Heisme's fishing gear, and when he's gonna do fishing, let's Understood. fish. The truth is. Tailbait. Then. So she'll know what hit them. Let's cast. Maybe it's. Oh, this staring. Uh, water surface is starting to feel like queasy. Swell like the waves. The fight is on. I'm. Oh, yup. Yep, the. Sh Heisman is stronger, guys. Mm. As many as I thought. Still can't. Uh, can't see the catch of a lifetime every day. I think that's a good catch list. Here we go. Attention strategy, lurk beneath the surface of calm, so make fishing such a beloved pastime. Then... As much as I'd hate to say it, I think it's time we call it a day. The gauntlet runner arrives at Cliffshade Camp, just as the curtain of night descends on the wilderness. Ideal for their cover, it works both ways, as monsters and rogues alike await their victims in the shadows of the rocks. Only a gauntlet runner offers peace of mind against such dangers. A large reason why they are so sought after. Anytime you catch the Lord of the Lake, Indeed. yeah. Especially if they're playing River King. I love that game. The temperature dropping since we made landfall. Maybe pretty cold in Altaberry. Hey, bro. <laughs> Strive Festival in the islands wasn't too bad, huh? Reminds me of the bashes we used to have with the other Parapus lads. They drew a smile, though. That was the biggest surprise. Never seen her so. Never mind. Forget I said anything. They should join us. Fidelio and, um. Basilio. We could all chill. Imagination. I don't need it, bro. I suppose we should, because she needs to get boosted. Oh my. Well, if it, you know, it's a board. Not in the mood to sing. It would be nice to have someone to talk to. <sighs> Can't believe we got a hold of that divine lance. I need to go for you as a wise move. Your strength and your strengths and competencies are impeccable, naturally. But most of all, I appreciate the rapport I've enjoyed with all of you. Strange. Seems like you fit right in. Got it. Mm. I was an adept in playing with my current surroundings, but I'm actually not doing much with you all. I'm just being myself. For so many people, I gave them what they desired. I performed the role of the sweet, virtuous Juno the Songstress. But you don't treat me that way? I was a little miffed and disappointed, to be honest. I'm sure you'll be the shining star one day. Actually, I'm absolutely positive about it. And this is coming from me, so you better believe in yourself. All right. Oh my god, that's a lot. Uh, is it time already? I do feel a bit drowsy, but we can talk a bit more. That was a lot. That was six points time of imagination. On, and the age of a new king draws nearer. It would seem that. Um, we now stand among the mountains. I long gazed at the peaks of Montario from the island, but I never imagined I would see them this close. Altaberry remains cold year round, so quite accordingly, its people have perfected the art of a piping hot stew. 
So home of the f uh, foremost opera house in the kingdom as well. I suppose that will be the stage of our confrontation with Elise. I guess. Let's keep our hopes high. Some tall mountains on the horizon. So? I expect sure our preparations are complete by tomorrow night. Hey, Fidelio. Oh. What time we made it to the mountains? Never much minded sea trial, though. Basilia, though, he turns green at the thought. Turning the land earlier than I expected. Shame about leaving the fish behind. Through the luxury of time of our journey, I wonder what uh, bounties the mountain in the woodlands I might have found as well. I'm, I'm assuming that you will have time when we hang out there, bro. Hey. Seems like Del's foot's healed up now, thanks to Lady Rella. Now oh, it's got you looking so pleased. Oh, I can't make sense of all of this. We need to... I'm assuming anything with the check mark we've made before. So we haven't made this, right? All right. I love how anything with like dough. <laughs> we've highs, but he just steps on it. I from a town that specialized in the production of grain, consequently I'm quite confident in the use of it in all culinary matters. I would have making dough from flour as well. I shall let you in on a secret. A good chef always listens to their dough. The dough one is ever evolving due to the temperature and humidity of the room, thus one must make the fine adjustments to the amount of water based on the present conditions. All well, Heisman's lead. Look! It's so funny. Once the dough has been properly formed, we must put our whole weight into flattening it out completely. This technique ensures the best texture. I trust you lend, uh, to lead us into the fray. But in this task, I fear that there's none I trust beyond myself. All right. And what she will um, impede the development of its texture. For now, we must enlist our eyes and noses as scouts, tasked with alerting us to the proper time to strike. They're really cooked. They s the smell alone is mouth watering. In days gone by, little noodles. The taste of my hometown. The aroma of nostalgia and hunger is an equal measure. Let's go, guys. All right, who wants to hang out? Oh, does Juno want to hang out? Cause I still want more eloquence. Although I, is she outside? Yeah, okay. She does not want to hang out. Come around the sleeping arrangements. I think it's cozy, which is calming. I still don't understand how our hair fits into one of those. Let's see how we'll come around to how tangled my hair is by morning. I know! I don't know how it fits! So many UFO wants to hang out? Morning, Yufa. Actually, join me in a bit of meditation. Sure. I'm very happy. Wonderful. Let us sit before the altar and let our spirits calm. <sighs> we hear wolves howling in the distance, but there's no way they can be near the gauntlet hunter, could they? Clear your thoughts. May I? During meditation, you must do not but feel yourself where you are in this time and place and accept it. Remember what you hear, just listen. Things, let things be as they are. Abandon yourself to the great flow of everything. <laughs> I try doing what Yufa's telling me. Let things be as they are. Please howl. All right. You wanna imagine the howling in the distance. Um, well. <laughs> are you thinking about something strange and proud right now? I just, the aura around me tells me you are. I couldn't remind myself with idle thoughts. I only improved right. slightly. That's slightly, it's five! Farewell. Let's relax a little. Relax a little. Let's keep this up a bit longer. I wish the character straight up held. Come look at this! Um, you aren't gonna believe the view I'm seeing. I'm hitting the brakes. A new picture. The gauntlet runner makes a short stop in front of Colorodio Cliff, a bluff so tremendous it fills one's vision. 
Its massive fissure is said to be the vestige of a god's wrath, as only a force capable of splitting heaven and earth could cause it. Perfectly balanced by the work of nature, or the wrath of gods extolled in the myths of creation, none can say. It is pretty. Whoa. That's incredible. I've heard, I've heard of sheer cliffs before, but I never imagined something like this. <sighs> Indeed, falling off that precipice would be unfathomably terrifying and exhilarating. Uh, sure. Mm -hmm. Let's try jumping off. Four-faced Sanctus Scullions. Oh, what's gotten into you? Uh, that was rather pleasant. It's quite refreshing, you know, but your voice from the very bottom of your gut and yell in such a matter. Speaking of... I am reminded of a time you were yelling at me before. It was a rather terrible experience, I admit. But if I may, I like, my, I like to try my hand at yelling. Listen! Never again shall I sleep in a roach-infested inn. I feel you. Yes. <laughs> I'm using, I'd like to try screaming as well. Hmm? What's the matter? I fully intend to do it, but the words won't come out, and I, um... <sighs> Trust just too charming, never change, love? Well, does anyone else have something to yell about? Since the gazing at the cl cliff's edge and being filled with an unexplainable urge to scream has somehow brought in my wisdom. All right. Bring it in. We still need tolerance and eloquence, but we do take these. As for me. It's old, this, uh, it's old nurse's turn. I had a list of complaints that I wish I could recite about you. Oh, I recite to you all day. What well, chilly out here. We should head back. We shouldn't allow ourselves to spend too much time with these distractions. Oh, he was ready, Bombs though. Away! I must scream. <laughs> As always, I've drawn this place here. Oh, he's so much stuff to give to Maria, the guys. The runner stops amidst rocky terrain as twilight envelops the wilderness in darkness. The twinkling lights are not all stars. Some are the eyes of monsters peering through the dark. To await the dawn in comfort and peace is a privilege only the gauntlet runner can provide. Guys, I have curry and banana bread for mm. after this. I'm so excited. Driven in town tomorrow, but by tomorrow this time. If we got a limited amount of time left to enjoy these quiet moments, once we're in Altaberry, well, you know it's gonna happen. Oh. This base will reach Altaberry sometime tomorrow. Got the lance in the end, so not denying you that it's uh, skill that we've got skills for this, but I'm still watching you. you. Hey. The night chills are creeping in. Suppose that means we're closing in Altaberry. Once the lance is in Lord Lisa's hands, I'll be out of your hair. Days really flew by. But they should both just join us. When we have the luck bath bomb, right? Do it with luck bomb. We don't need to hang out with Hulkenberg right now, though. Oh, goodness. I'm conflicted. Yes? <laughs> Hi, Spang always wants to hang out. We need to hang out with Hulkenberg again before she wants to hang out again? Okay. Hulkenberg! Well met. Don't suppose you're overburdened with free time? Sort of a stranger to traveling, but I have no idea how to spend idle hours. Magnificent! Burger Island was truly splendid to think that so many delicacies could be found in one place. I make no hesitation in declaring it the, uh, at a blessed island, oh, with a myriad of fish species and the rare species, oh, with serpent serpentia. Dishes are uh, truly moved me. Found it stimulating. That's right. Indeed. I heartily agree. It was the way it was grilled. It was a plethora of spice. Uh, the plethora of spices was truly remarkable. 
braised dish deserves a was served with a soup that was delicious according to locals it already is best are fermented and consumed raw it's a shame we arrived and the dish was out of season I digress. Our focus turns to our next destination, Altabury. To save his highness the prince, we cannot fail to eliminate now Maurice. Then. It releases one of the strongest mages alive. We acquired a divine relic, but will be enough. I don't know if we should be talking about this when the brothers are like right upstairs. Now forgive me. Such uncertainty does not for our cause. Upon arrival, I shall erase my doubts with the aid of a good meal. The cuisine of that city is uh, familiar to me. I believe no, rather, no doubt, both the meal and our mission will be arousing successes. All right. Four. Okay, that's what I figured most of it was. I got so much that one time. Tis a later hour than we realized. I know our journey demands ample rest, but you, I would like to continue conversing with you. Nice. Time marches on, and the age of a new king draws near. I don't think we nearer. need to cook anything else. I think we've made everything we can. I'm trying to make everything. Tis nearly time. Uh, tis only a ways further until you reach Alterbury. The city is likely abuzz with the activity of really uh, related to Saint's Day. Our Felice is already there. Sooner or later, we have to hand over Dr Dracodios to him. Like Draco Dios, though, right? Um, one must wonder if what the brothers will tell him over time on the island. I hope they, they leave out any unnecessary details. Got to stand tall and be confident. If you have to sell a, a lie, look him straight in the eye, say it like you uh, believe every word. It's raining, but I'm assuming it'll start snowing soon. Right. Got a sec? The last time, we'll be able to relax for a while until you arrive. We'll be jumping right into it. I can't blame you for feeling nervous after all. Or I'll save them. <laughs> Divine Lance. So they can call it reclamation, but those Sanctus are pillaging the pagan's treasures, plain and simple. Sanctum has got nothing for us. I no faith in their god or their sanctors. That's why we stand with Cat Louise. Lucilio. I'm assuming you're not outside because it's raining. I mean, like, bro could be. No. Uh, strolls ready to hang out. <laughs> right. Okay. Wolkenberg wants to hang out. All things that we don't particularly want to boost are available right now. Oh, hi. Damn it. This thing's festival is it. I get a pit in my stomach. Just think about, uh, going, thinking about it going off without a hitch. At least it gives me a chance to hear Lady Juna sing, though. Better clean your ears out. It's a privilege to listen to her. Yeah. Hey. The time, I was gonna do maintenance on my weapons. At the time, why not join me? All right, best boy, I'm ready. Now then. The time was stroll on in our weapons. All right. I'm just sad it doesn't have dialogue anymore because we've done it so much. Ah, uh, Nira speaking. I've got something on the old girl's radar, so I'll be taking a short stop.
Before Alteberry's oh, another mountains, one. the gauntlet runner sets upon the murky graveyard. You're gonna draw a graveyard? The bridges overhead are an impressive sight. During the Annex War, this land was a fierce battleground. Many soldiers, unable to return to their loved ones, found their final rest here. But few honor the dead. Their spirits take no solace. Their tragic remains are desecrated by wild dogs, leaving their bones exposed to the elements. This angle's nice. Just look at it! These bridges are huge. It is an area defined by its numerous valleys. The bridges connect the flatlands and increase the amount of places in which people may live. Makes sense, but if these bridges were to fall in battle, those people would end up isolated. Hey. Very fascinating. We've, uh, have you looked what's directly in front of you? These are bones of people, aren't they? They are the remains of those who fell during the Annex War. So let's say, this is the site of a fierce battle, and the dead were left to the elements denied the dignity of a proper burial. And it's tragic. <sighs> War's tragic, and we shouldn't restrict the fallen here. Yeah. Indeed, I can't bear to think of something on the scale happening again. It's no pleasure to see it. It is no, it is valuable to experience the cold reali reality of battle beyond legends. Carbs and marine to your heart. <sighs> this is why the magla that drifts uh, about this place carries such an oppressive weight. I feel the sadness and regret of those whose lives came to an end here. Wisdom. All right. Uh... Hey! Something wrong if you're scum blue. Oh, well, there's a shadow behind you. That. Hey! Do you refrain from doing that again? Uh, this. Uh, things of this matter are not my forte. <laughs> Surprised you put any stock into scary stories. You're more of a general soul than I gave you credit for. Too true, too true. Before all else, I'm a delicate flower. Well then. Should I make a quiet departure so as not to rouse the dead? That's my fault. I made such a fuss. I'd like to give those who died a proper send off. Take the swing so I don't forget people whose lives came to end here. And give it to Maria. Alterbury Heights, capital of the Principality of Montario, the eastmost country annexed into the Kingdom of Ucronia. The mountain path leading to the city begins near the coastline, but few gauntlet runners can contend against its steep slope. Those who complete the arduous climb are rewarded. City lights, dusted with snow, twinkle beautifully in the valley. But what awaits the party there is no reward, but their greatest trial thus far. It's snowing now. The hour of right. reckoning draws near, and they steal themselves anew. Anime. The seat of sanctism, Alterbury. Truly, I never thought I would see it in person. What is that giant structure? The monolith. In Sanctus scripture, they tell of how the stone was shaped by God's own hand. It's a float. I'd only heard rumors that it didn't touch the ground, but to see it now. <sighs> Are we finally moving again? <laughs> Just another trip for our songstress. Oh, we're here at last. It would be so useful if Juno was the one that, like, was able to control the, uh, teleportation function, because she's been, like, everywhere. We just go everywhere immediately. Mm. I decided to present Luis with Draco Dios, the Lance of Dragon God, on board his Gauntlet Runner. Let's hope he doesn't find out the Lance is fake. Well done. So this is the Lance of Legend, is it? I am called Euphasia, priestess of the island. For personal reasons, I have joined them on their journey. You do not detest me? I owe my life to them, and I understand they operate under your guidance. Indeed. I had heard you were able to obtain the Lance without incurring the islander's hatred. Quite a feat, now that I know it to be true. Well done. At last, it seems that even fate has abandoned Fortinbras. 
Thanks to you, I was spared the effort of sifting through ashes to find this. If the islanders could not be persuaded, my next course would be to raise their village to the ground. The Caradrius' batteries would make that a fairly simple task. What? Hmm? Why are you surprised? At times, sacrifice is necessary to save the many. Was that not the exact reasoning by which your countrymen would have seen you die? You're... Have the lance brought to my chamber later. Thank you for your hard work in spite of your wound. Take care of yourselves. Now we need only to wait until tomorrow for the Saints' Day Festival. The whole event will be held over two days at the Opera House. The first day is the eve of the festival, and I'm scheduled to sing. Hope you're looking forward to it. Main festivities start on the second day. That's when all these divine relics will be dedicated and sealed. It's aimed at proving beyond a doubt that Sanctism is the highest authority. All kind of daft though, isn't it? If they were that confident in their scriptures, you'd think they wouldn't have to bother with all that. This is where Forden dies. He and Sanctism itself. At the very least, it's worth giving him a memorable end. Guys. It would be, I know this is not like gonna happen because we're not playing not towards the end of the game, but it'd be so nice if he just killed Forden and then we killed him and we're just like, yes. Lord Louise, I do hope you'll come and watch me sing this time. We missed you at the opening ceremony. If you're not there, it'll hardly be worth it. You needn't worry. Having come all this way, it would be a waste not to show. Well. I'm off to check out the Opera House. Want to make sure everything's ship shaped for my solo, of course. The rest is up to you. You have all performed admirably. You exceeded my every expectation. Soon, Forden's reign will come crashing down. From this point onward, I would have you forfeit the competition and dedicate yourself fully to my campaign. Understood. For now, Rest your wings a while. Tomorrow's festivities will be a grand show indeed. It seems the lands passed muster. Nuras is a peerless craftsman, if not else. <sighs> Yufa, are you okay? He would have... He would have destroyed my home. How could he suggest such he killed carnage the king and tried to kill the prince? I was sure that deep down, all people are inherently good at heart. But now, you made it sound like you were bound to kill him at any cost. And now I understand why. I see. Then let's get back on track and go find ourselves an inn. You've got more supporters now. I dare say we'll find better lodging than we could before. I wouldn't be so sure. This city's in the palm of Forden's hand, and we're the ones who humiliated him during the exhibition. All the same, we're about to do something big. To be honest, I'll take anywhere, so long as I can stretch out. Um... It's cold. Uh, it's cold. Yeah, I'm freezing my wings off. Uh, then why don't we look for an inn run by a Mustari? I thought this city was the seat of the church. In times before the church, it said many diverse faiths and teachings took root in this city. That's why Montario is the only mainland nation that trades with the islands. Indeed. My grandfather often said that until his generation, the only prominent building of the Sanctus Church was that opera house. Though the prevailing story now, of course, is that Sanctism reclaimed this land from malevolent pagans. Either way, I'm certain there should be quite a few Mustari who feign conversion and live in seclusion. If one of these Mustarians really exists, it may work in our favor. Let's look for it. Let's see. Are we running around or are they going to teleport us? Speaking of. All right. Um, if it's Mustari owned and we seek, then I know of one in the center of town. It's called Scour Tavern. Scour Sword. I recall it being rather pleasant with the uh, with very little that would point to its mystery roots. Certainly. It was on Dia Bronco Street, if I'm mistaken. 
Let's hope is in an element. Can we get going before we freeze? Why, you little- Is that driver getting lost in the mountains and snowless? I thought I'd freeze to death. I'm supposing, I'm supposing the ends around here will be full too. On earth, we'll have to go to the far side of the street. Well met, eh? Hey! Welcome to Altsbury. Good lord. Uh, aren't you the elder candidate? Out with you. Go once you came. This land is under the protector... At protectorate of the Sanctuary Church. We shelter no heathens. Mm, guess we've reached some level of notoriety, haven't we? <laughs> um, this is the best. I hear the there's a motley crew of the candidates gathered here. This year's Saint's Day is looking to be the most festive celebration we've had yet. I've heard rumors those relics once belonged to the church. What for me and his eminence, Forden is standing as as good as a sword. Oi! Oh, we want. <sighs> Finally got those nobles off my carriage. It's always like this around Saint's Day. Can't abide how self-absorbed these oity to uh, oity toits are. So cold. I'm wagon sick. Route to bury is up in the uh, bloody mountain, did you? If you get like the carriage, go and buy yourself a gauntlet runner, why don't you? Well, it put me out of a job, though. It's so funny. What in the blazes? Stop! Ew, you're the elder who made a mess of the exhibition in Brylehaven, aren't you? Listen here, Altaria is the strongest uh, stronghold at the Saintish Church. You don't stand a chance here. Bro. Oh, cripes. Don't mind me. I'm looking for bugs. <laughs> Wonderful, isn't it? Oh there. Um, is the view here not spectacular? That's impressive structure there is called the monolith. The rumors are true. It looks like a, a sculpture jutting out of the sky more than the ground. Truly a sight to behold. The top rose at this base. It's truly a sit the city's landmark. It's worth a trip from Grand Trad. Wonderful, isn't it? <laughs> yes, hello. My well, not in my wildest imaginings did I believe you'd survive so long. In all honesty, I'm shocked you made it past the exhibition. Nevertheless, you'll be sorry to know I've acquired my offering relic as well. Such a spectacular offering will surely astound the citizens and canids alike. <laughs> Hang on. That's the one from the exhibition. Yeah, it's Stay us. There. Oh my, that's a, that's a big town. Right. You. Y'all are causing the rumors that other candidate Loveless has been searching all over you. Don't know we did the lad, but I don't want any trouble in the city. What is it? My thing, down there's the hot spring in the magic shop, hardly worth the climb back up. The whole city is excavated out uh was excavated out of the mountainside. Get used to it. My money's on Santa Fe's that order. damned Luis. I love how everyone just cursed at Luis. Alright then. It's our people, guys. Well well. Don't be surprised. You've been here telling me he's also a tainted divine relic. Hardly lifted a finger to get mine, thanks to my contacts, but uh can only imagine the toll it's taken on you. Bye, though, bye. There's a podium in the city, too, isn't there? I'd see them frugally in Brylehaven, but to be so. honest, I couldn't bear to listen. The ravings of madmen. Cheap ale, the only purpose of which was to intoxicate the masses. Perhaps time. I just have a pulpit. Electing a king and looking to f uh, the further requires... The future requires... The acumen of an intelligent thinker. Hmm... Greetings. Now then. Nice. I can wait until a sales day for that. Hmm. 
bug. Huh? Fear the increasing number of warrior monks as Saint's Day approaches. We have converted th to their Saintist faith, yet they still despise us. So in their hearts, they still see us as lesser. I couldn't tell me what uh, Mestari had been in prison for crimes they didn't commit. Get yourself a good deal here. Oh, yeah, discounts. How much improvement do you get? Oh, that's not much. Not much. Oh, oh well, that's actually kind of nice. <laughs> what do we got going on in here? Ah, hello. Armor shop. I'm surprised it's not that much of an improvement. We got some pretty good gear it's looking like. <sighs> Alright, let's go. See if we can't find ourselves an inn. Come take a gander. They say it's the best, even the cool like this. I'm raking in the sale. St. Nets Ford and St. Rella's portraits are high in demand every year. I did hope Master Godot would be moving a little better. He's a candidate to the throne after all. Oh well, I suppose I overpriced him. What's up? For place to stay, and right up ahead. Who'll take the crown now? You're not serious. What you got? Oh my! Started growing flowers. Yes. Not too much of a kind of commitment. Oh, well, that's... Take the hero's jewel birds. <laughs> yes! What do you want to do? My sincerest thanks. A return your love and care. All right, then. Food up here. Oh, grand. Hello there. Oh, my God. Sure. In water. <laughs> Always nice. Nice. Again, okay, we're looking to make every food dish, so oh, um Alright then. Oh grand. All right, then. Up here. <laughs> oh. All right, then. How grand. How grand. Oh, is it another down over here? Hello there. Okay. Yeah, amazing. Well, then, if you For say the inn run by the Star Tribe, just go down this path and it'll be on your right. Memory serves me right. It's called the Skyward Tavern. Who says uh, the wretched knave who commanded subordinates to steal the royal scepter from the Grand Cathedral and Grand Trad? I can only imagine what wicked tricks the village has up his sleeve for Saint's Day. No harm preparing for the worst. I'm sure it'll be fun. Nothing bad's gonna now happen, guys. Do. You little. I'm gonna decide to turn up. Got some nerve showing up in front huh? of me. What? Did we do something? Blame the fool, are we? I see your game. What's good, uh, what's good for the goose is good for the, also the short, oh, let's be shortly. It's not too many. Should let him be. Welcome. Wait. A band of youths with a knight and a you chief. Hi. Are you perhaps the candidate who brought Joanna the Sanctares to confess? Yeah. One glance and you knew. Listen, we just... I don't care if you did the deed or not, but please take your business elsewhere. I'm sorry, but I have my own reputation to think about. You follow Sanctism's teachings? You? A Mastari who wears no mask? I'm Euphasia, 
I'm the priestess of Virga. No, of Edria. The priestess? Impossible! The island priestess would never leave the village behind. I have my reasons. But I wish to see the outside world that I might better protect our island. I have no proof, but... You would raise another tribe to the throne. Tis a longer story than we've time to tell. We only wish to avoid a tyrant's reign. Yet tis not from our own ambition that I speak so. The throne belongs to one truly worthy. But if you insist, we will leave. Uh, it's just... You look so like the priestess before you, I can't just turn you away. Fine. You can stay here, as long as Let's you don't go. make trouble for me. Thank you. I suppose it is easier to understand each other without the masks in the way. Not all of us mainland Mistari hate the Sanctus Church. We'd rather preserve the peace we have. And, well, it's a sorry excuse for an innkeeper who turns away travelers. Thank you. We're in your debt. Oh, look, they've got food and booze here, too. And it's so much cooler, which means fewer bucks. Perfect. I need those beetles. It seems they have an imitation of the island spring here. We can bathe. I should invite Juno when she's back. Bathe? <laughs> You'd be mad to hope a hot spring replica could take the edge off this chill. Cold or not, there's nothing more refreshing than bathing. Would you care to join us? I... I should think not. For reasons too numerous to count. Why? Anyway, strategy meeting. Let's get on with it. So we seek to assassinate Luis. A difficult task. But you look to have an idea. Let's have it. First, the when. Under normal circumstances, we'd want to get him on the move. Maybe walking through a crowd while he's got less guards. That would be the plan. But unfortunately, that'd only work if he was someone with common sense. Someone without combat ability. Or someone who'd want to avoid collateral damage. And that isn't Luis. Worst case, he uses civilians as shields while more of his personal guard catch up. And things go sideways before we can get it done. But once he's inside the Opera House, he'll have a security detail at his beck and call. Even if we can sneak in, getting to him. If we can't target him in transit, and we've practically zero chance of getting close to him, that leaves us with only one option. Join his personal guard. We join his personal guard ourselves? I considered that, but it might be tricky. We can't guarantee he'd allow it, and besides... The real lance is overflowing with Magla. It would be a dangerous gamble to keep it on hand. That sort of power is easily noticed. All right. Oh, we can't really attack from a distance, but... We attack from a distance. Exactly. A bow and arrow isn't going to do much good, right? It needs to be the lance. Of course. So... Who has... What if we threw the lance? Like... Pierced him through from a distance. Lance throwing abilities. Yufa, as the priestess, you can command the lance to return to you if it's far away, right? You would have me use that power in reverse to cast it out instead. According to Juna, the ceiling of the Opera House has a chandelier big enough to support a person. From above, we'll target Luis in the wall what box the... You realize the entire audience is below that lighting? A stunt like that would get us noticed instantly. Wait, are you suggesting we do this during the show? Best Luis time. Luis would be distracted. It's the best opportunity we could ask for. Besides, with you for there, we can even recover the lance easily. Hold a moment. I would need to launch it like an arrow. Such distance and such speed would require incredible focus. I, I don't think I could do it while aiming. Then just concentrate on the sheer mental force of it. Someone else can take over the role of actually throwing. This gambit is sounding more far-fetched by the moment. But we also can't afford to wait for another opportunity. There is no other opportunity. Luis intends to kill Forden during the festival. We should let him do that part. That means if we do nothing, the fake <laughs> we will be exposed. We should let him do that part. And so will we. Indeed. 
Once our betrayal is made plain, we will never find a way to draw close to him again. This will likely be our first and last opportunity. But who's actually going to do the throne? It's gonna be us. I'd rather leave it oh, to you. Oh, no. With the royal magic protecting you, it's less likely that we'll fail this, even with interference. And besides, laugh if you like. I know it sounds silly, but I really do believe you have the power oh, to change fate itself. <laughs> Indeed. Everyone here knows that firsthand. I feel the same. If I can trust you to do it, then I should be able to do my part as well. Will you do it, Captain? Sure. All right. I'll do it. Thanks. We owe you. On the day of, Juno will be at the venue ahead of us. We'll have her open the service entrance, and we'll infiltrate from there. Is there anything I can do to help? I want you to lure Luis's guards outside and cause a commotion while he's making the throw. I'm sure the Magnus brothers will be guarding the place too. Hulkenberg and I will secure the exit route in advance. Luis I don't is want them to try to body block. Foe. I feel like they would. But we've overcome plenty of obstacles. Let's believe in the strength that got us this far. We can do this. about it i know there's a lot weighing on your mind right now but let's just try to get some rest prepared for tomorrow it'll get colder at night so let's try not to get sick at last the rest of the finally saint's day at least will show his face and with the real ants will don't be worried i'm prepared to do what i uh, we must it must be stopped oh we got this out i love it so much that's that's my that's my <laughs> like life attitude for sure and the fact that the lance passed uh muster as testament in Ross's skill sometimes the man can achieve truly amazing things but even now he's all up in the runner working away tooting something or other with his usual vigor i don't doubt it he's his quirks to be sure but there's no mistaking that he's a great credit to our endeavors for sure <sighs> uh first time seeing snow it was so cold and i shivered what a sensation she was meeting with us later tonight because she's many things she's doing behind the scenes. Go ahead and rest. Huh. Salted brewery, huh? Colder climates tend to inspire uh, stronger drinks among its people. But that could wait until after our business is finished. Oh, I get that, like, nice, like, private bed over here. Yes. Good night. Late night. Oh, oh, what are they talking about? They don't trust us still, right? Hmm. What's wrong, Del? You've been quiet for a while now. That lance they handed over. <laughs> you think it's real? Yeah, of course. Can't say for certain, but I didn't feel any magla flowing through it. Can't see it exactly, but... How do I explain it? <sighs> I know what you mean, though. The Mustari got them third eyes that can see Magla, right? Hard to believe they'd worship that thing as a relic. Then maybe... You think they made some kind of fake? Even in that short time on the island? Shite. How'd they... Either way, we have to tell Lord Luis. Ugh, no need. He'll have noticed by now, most likely. Not like they're any real threat to him anyway. Most likely? That good enough for you, brother? Hmm. They should just join us. Tell. You remember they talked all that helping anyone in need? Something like that, anyway. Seemed proper daft at first. Seemed naive to act like that kind of thinking could actually fix all the broken, cruel, unjust shite in the world. That's because it can't. Well, yeah, obviously, but... What was it we actually wanted in the first place? Equality? Or justice? This lot's working towards the future, and God help me, I started seeing it. Maybe what they're fighting for is something better than what Lord... That's enough, Baz. No, no. Joke or not, Join us. Us. killed. But them Lord even helped you out a few times, Del. That really impressed me, like... I don't know how to say it, but... It was like a feeling I haven't felt since we started working for the Count. You know, Lord Luis plans to take Forden out during the Saints' Day Festival. 
Neither of us can afford to get distracted right now. I suppose you're right. Things are about to get messy. Yo, they don't know. They don't even know. Mm. So that is the side they serve. Let us teach them that even the best laid plans will go awry. Whether Fordens or our fallen kings. It was splendid entertainment while it lasted. However, the revelry ends here. Time marches on, and the age of a new king draws nearer. Headline? It's a headline. The Saints Day festivities in Alterbury will be kicking off very soon. On the eve of the festival, we'll be holding a dedication ceremony. <laughs> That's a lot ceremony. of cheese. Oh my god! The authority will be offering the gathered That's all for divine you. I don't like cheese, but That's all for you. And it sounds like the candidates had a tough time this go around. That's all. That's all for you. Lots of new info coming in even as I speak from candidate Rudolph, a legendary nail thought lost to history. From candidate Julian, can you believe it? Cloth garb said to have been worn by a saint. We've got artifacts of all kinds pulled from obscurity into the public eye. Archaeologists everywhere are positively vibrating, folks. But the news on everyone's lips. I have a luxury cheese, so there should probably not much cheese, is it? Is unofficial participation. Like, there's a lot As of a cheese. Of fact, but like, you get a lot more cheese if you wanted it. Acquired a phenomenal divine relic from a mysterious and exotic island. Meanwhile, candidate Forden too may have claimed what is said to be the most glorious relic in history. Will we finally see a head-to-head -head competition between our top candidates? Only the coming days will tell. So Luis has finally made his move. Won't take him that long to catch up, I bet. Yes, but I also can't imagine Sanctifex Forden losing. We're about to see a clash of giants. This will be no mine about, that's for certain. It's time, guys. Right. That's everyone. Let's go over the plan one last time. First, infiltration. Juna's got full rights to be in the venue, so she'll unlock the service door for us to sneak in. When it's time, I'll call the guards outside. That'll be your window to sneak in. Gallica, you and Yufa. You three will head to the rooftop, where you'll get down to the chandelier. When I start my solo on stage, the lights will dim. That should be enough cover to hide whatever you're doing. Don't worry, I'll be with you. As for us, it's just as I explained last night. Louise said destroying Yufa's home would have been a necessary sacrifice. Like mine. If power's all he thinks will change the world, then we'll use power to stop him. Should we fail, though we may survive the ordeal, we will have no more leads to pursue. This will surely mark our final mission. I assure you, I think we're like, you know, probably about halfway through this game. I've been trying to keep <laughs> from dwelling, but... I can't help but think of Grias. I miss Grias, guys. Sorry to bring that up now. Even I have my fears. But let us remember him only by his truest wish. We will make sure this succeeds. For a world without tyrants. Well, see you at the show. We got this. So begins our last mission, then. No. Let's get whatever we need to prepare no. and head over to the Opera House. I think we're ready. Right. We'll finally settle the score with Louise. Be okay. I'll be fine. I know you'll be able to do it. That person's located at the highest point in the city. It'll be you and Yufa in there, so make sure you're geared up. Can I change her gear right now? Let's go see. <laughs> Oops. What now? There we go. Sounds like a lovely time. Okay. Ours <sighs> is the same. All right. 
Now what am I to do? Anything around here? All right then. Wait, it's discount day. <laughs> See, sense my love. This is misunderstanding. I thought the room was empty, so I absent mindedly call myself for something you regret. What the? A dairy spy on me in my room? I can't believe you saw me without my. I'm so humiliated. I'd rather die than being seen without my glamours. You can get through this. What do you understand of Weenadia? Don't just spout nonsense. So angry right now? Don't think dying will calm me down. Goodness. Proper aces. Now what am I to do? Oi! I'm a ready. <sighs> I don't know if you know general's the best thing to be fighting him, know. but you know. Beg pardon? I'm sure it's fine. Uh -huh. Oh grand. Um oh, grand. Hi. I don't think there's anything we particularly need right now. So we're probably okay. <laughs> On the up and up? That's um, um. not what I expected. Oi, oi! Oh, so right here. Oh, someone needs help. What do you need? Check this out. Service entrance student is supposed to do something about the guards before the ni uh, night before, and so we want to wait until then. Let's come back later. First off. All good. I am ready, but I want to look around, yes. It's you. Oh, it's you. Made it. Oh, the One Piece! The One Piece is real. Made all it to Montario and One Piece, did you? Not bad. Consider me impressed. And the competition in, uh, competition in the tournament will only get more brutal from here on out. Tell me, do you have, have you seen a Loveless yet? Best keep an eye on him. Wonderful. Now, isn't that something? Oi, there. That will be quite enough. So irreverent. I've seen the white clouds over there. Those brave guys are acting at, like they own the place. Oh, they may be feared the strongest army of the nation. We more your monks still of our pride. We'll be hosting the mo uh, most eminent dignitaries in the nation and divine relics. I swear in the name of Sanctism that our security is impenetrable. Oh, I'm sure Boy, it that. is. Hello the All right, we're all up through there. It's only for Gotlin runners. Proper races. All right, no, we're gonna all save him. Beg pardon? And then head on in. It's so weird the number of saves in this of 16. Well, now, what are we on about? Are you staring out? Do you, uh, you don't have any business at the service door, do you? Hoping to uh, catch a glimpse of the ancillary song. Believe me, I'd love to meet Lady Junior myself. Security is very tight right now. Don't uh, you think you've put them, uh Don't you think putting vicious guard dogs backstage is too much? They're being paranoid, if you at ask last. me. Let's wait. Can do this? For me, it'll just be you, me, and Yufa. Make sure your equipment is where you want it to be set. Yes. All right, let's follow the plan and wait here. Got it. All right, the guards have left their post. Juno's done her job. And she also unlocked the service entrance for us. Let us enter and remain unseen. Stealth. All right. Infiltration successful. So, should we leave to backstage? From there, we climb up to the roof and atop the chandelier. Yes. I'm on route to the auditorium on the other side. I have to lure those brothers out so. somehow. Stroll and I will secure an exit route. Yeah. Let's hold up from here. Let's do our parts and regroup. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go, indeed. We got this, guys. And if we're under level, I don't think we are. All right. Let's let their operation. We need to get up on the chandelier and be positioned before Juno finishes I'm singing. Sure of it. Beyond the chandelier, we need to reach the roof. 
That's right. Juno laid it out for us. Head backstage. We should be able to go up from there. Time to go. Spin our way up then. First. Ugh. Elder candidate. What's one of Luis's dogs doing here? Master Godot's monk army is guarding the opera house, so don't get any funny ideas. Locked, yo. Yo, we love Majima. Are you guys ready what? for in February? <sighs> that we're only playing the Majima game? The Pirate Yakuza game? Ridiculous. Oh. Uh, it's not here either? Where'd I drop it? How important could be if he dropped it? Very, you know what? It's very important. <laughs> You're not safe. Look! Stretch, thank you. Here's the door leading backstage. We should be able to access the roof from here. What was that the guy standing in front of the door muttering? <gasps> something happened. Did I drop hey. it somewhere? Is something wrong? <laughs> oh, I just dropped my key somewhere. Now I can't open this door of all the times. It has to be when we're busy beyond belief. I have to go get a spare. I'm looking for a key you dropped. Hmm. He left, and now we gotta deal with the locked door. Actually, it works here, I suppose. If we drop his key, finding will be our, will be our, we'll get our plan back on track. If so, if we ask the, the patrons out the key, then. Yep, we're safe here. <laughs> Everything's pretty standard. I feel like we should be able to find it by like default. Yep, we're safe here. Do, do I have to socialize for this key? Gosh, do you? That damned Luis. Oh, I'm starving. I should have brought something to, to take. eat. Hey. That damned Luis. Speaking of which, rumors about you. They say you killed the sea monster outside Brylhaven, which means Eminence brought the brought a fake one. Now they spitting in the face of, uh, face of the church. You're an interesting mm. fellow. Oh, sure, thank you. Posture is checked. <laughs> we'll probably be ending soon-ish. I just want to see this go down because we'll be playing this all like all all stream tomorrow. Thank you for alert. Thank you. Thank you. We seems to be in a high alert today. They've even brought guard dogs along. Perhaps it's because Luis is here, but the royal magic would prevent any sort of assassination, mm. would it not? Ridiculous. Why is this happening? Some sort of string. Honestly, maybe it's be useful. It's all into it. Why is this happening? <sighs> Golden tooth. <sighs> what the silver necklace? What's this? What if? Imagine it blocks the one around here. Alright, so it's like trade for Say stuff, that. right? Well, isn't that something? Here's Eminence Ford has acquired a magnificent divine relic. With that, his victory is all but assured. Perhaps I but I've no doubt Luis has something up his sleeve to achieve such success at his age. We can't count on him. Let's <laughs> um, hmm. <laughs> litter with awesome items today. I guess it's no surprise with all these people here. We've got lots to do. Can't pick up each and every one. If you find something, be back up to return to its owner. Uh, I'm possibly hideous without my tooth. That this is a disaster. Me. Maybe we got a gold tooth earlier. Can't imagine it belongs to anyone else. Thank you very my much. My tooth, indeed. you spied my distress and sought to rectify it, didn't you? I'm saved. Now I can social life without appearing with a gap in my teeth. Yes, thanks. Take this key I picked up in the corridor. <laughs> You may get a reward if you return it. Uh, don't worry about me. Is this perhaps? Okay, we're looking for. Yes, yeah. so we found it. I feel like our reward seemed more like errands. But let's uh, all sell the ends well. Yay! We've done it. <laughs> I've done it now. How long is it taking to change? Play's gonna Actually, start. Some of the matters seem rather troubled. Did Ezra leave the dressing room? I left my script in there. Need it yes. back.
What? I can't find my necklace. I've searched everywhere. I can't find it. It's supposed to be... I suppose I dropped Say. it in the hallway. I've seen a uh, silver necklace. What if... I just picked up. Perhaps it's theirs. This is it. How is it that you found it? My beloved gave me this necklace. We aren't able to see each other right now in any case. What give you a reward? How about this? It's an exclusive preview of the Saints Day play script. <laughs> now you got this for me. I'm saved. I don't have much to give, but please take this. Oh, thank you. Come on! <laughs> Simmons Ford is, of course, a fine candidate, but it's Professor Julian who will end up being most fit to be king. Pyrrhus. Uh, appear to have d obtained a divine relic without any trouble. And despite this, it means unpopular. It's curious. I suppose it uh, indicates just how intelligent the masses truly are. Tragic when you're an intelligent ruler. Why is this happening? <laughs> Alright, Milos, Chris Wing and Saints Day this year. How I've longed to gaze at the uh, divine features once more. My father told me to support his eminence. But I don't care what he says. For, my feelings for Lord Milo are a tie that cannot be stopped. <sighs> Loveless. As your friends from uh, dropping out of the race, Parapus are a foolish tribe to begin with, but the longer that he, that man remains, the bolder they'll grow. <sighs> we should break your kneecaps. What is it? This is me. I'll let you know that I'll be swayed by an elder candidate. I'm proud to support Rudolph and his visions as a Rosant ruler. For, uh, besides, when you say there's something rather alluring about such a severe man, who wants this string we picked up? <laughs> say that. Uh, what am I to do? My shoe is to break all oh, that go. The Crown 3 XC officials have already gathered, but I can't hardly tend to them with my shoe like this. Sure it. We picked up a string earlier, did we not? Close your eye. Oh, just could use a shoe lace replacement. Thank you. I'm trying a more proper award for you, but I don't. Still, this case famous here and tasty. I promise. Thank you. Uh, yeah. I have done it all. Say that. Ah. <sighs> Why is this happening? I assume these are all locked. <laughs> yeah. Say, have you heard? Have you heard rumors about Lady Juna? She was spotted leaving Luis's gauntlet runner. She's top saunters shacking up with Luis. Wow. Get it, girl. That's insane. Oh, my. I heard from the crier. Did you really go all the way to the Pagan's Island for a divine relic? This crier said you found something amazing on that island, but he's just spinning tall tales, isn't he? Or. <laughs> You're not sick. Oh, we're still in the dungeon right now? What now? Interesting. Okay. Yay! We've done it! Ready? This goes backstage where you should be able to reach the roof. Are you ready? <laughs> Let's go. Let's take a peek inside first carefully so we don't get caught. Check this out. Uh, should we get backstage from there? Makes sense there are guards. Not many of them, though. Should we push through? Oh. At risk if we draw attention here, we'll not shake it easily. The point, or should we had a surefire plan for this? What? Huh? What? It's so dark all of a sudden. What, what's happening? I'll turn off the lights. It's gonna have happened at a worse time. We can't have this ruining Saint Stay's festivities. So apparently, that takes care of that. What? So the lights. As Hulkenberg to do it, it'll be dark forever. So get moving while that you can. That is a great help. Got it. Once the exit route is secured, Hulkenberg and I will group with you. The rest is up to you. Let's go. Let's sneak through. So we'll have to fight with just these two for a bit and then they'll come. Okay. The future is uncertain. The backstage passage lights that are is... out. It's reported. We've already fixed the issue, but we can't figure out how it happened. Either it's a black accident or. I believe I was uh, charged with the security of the venue. Assume everything is in order. Or stretch remnants. I'll investigate it immediately. Understood. Increased security. Call on the reserves too. We can't be too careful. Y yes, as you wish. Good grief! He's gonna bit thick back here. Um, they would seem to have a lot on their uh, a lot on their hands, keeping in no. order. That's my cue. Now. 
At long last, she comes to the highlight of the festival. The dedication ceremony of Divine Relics will begin very soon. Take a look! Gathered here are the only competitors fierce enough to survive the first round and got their hands on a relic. At last! So you're cheering? Sounds like it's getting underway. I have some official to do the preamble for a while. And they'll start the actual dedication. Juno's to sing after that. We need the chandelier before them. Get to fight. They'll target you first since you're protected by royal magic. Make sure to keep an Let's eye on go. her. Sorry about this. A plan won't work without you or Yufa. Let's hurry. I mean, I can just run away from everyone. I'm fairly confident in my abilities. Should just get out of there. No way! Sir, uh, guard dog's backstage. Oh, it's fine. Yeah, nice work! Let's push through! Our enemies have discovered us! Ow. Ow. Alright, we did it! I knew you could do it! Come on! Let's this do is it! This is our chance! Uh, do it. It. Quick, everyone, go! Let's go! Fire! Burn! Hey. What a finale! I just guess, since the other everyone. doggos were also weak against that. I've done it! We're done. That was all of them. Who's there? Hi. Someone's back here. Aren't you the elder candidate? Uh. You're cut right away. No choice but to force your way through. Must be you who cut the lights, dogs of Louise. You won't wreck Saint's day on my watch. Careful, the royal magic protects him. But he'll surrender if we kill his allies. Watch out! So we're doing it this way. Uh, Aoife falls, the mission fails. Oh no. Time for some close cop to the rear guard. General! Burn! You hit their weakness! Oh, there's that. opening, Captain. Come forth now! This is the last. I'm capable too. Hearts, forward. Take that. This closure. Right. Hearts, summoner. Run. It is your turn. Nice. Yay! We've done it. You're so good. Whoa. I love it. I love how they straight up just tell you this is not the end of the game by giving you that. <laughs> they give you something that needs to be appraised. Like I didn't think it would be, but like they they just confirmed it. They be confirming. Hmm. Oh, do we nice. like just I pick? But can we fight? Can we fight all of them? Gangway! Huh. Huh. Yeah. Ow. This won't stop us. No. <laughs> and they're dead this turn. So. Burn! You hit their weakness. Summoner. That's your opening, Captain. Come forth now. This Got is the last. Him. Keep Amazing it up. work, Yufa. The battlefield is mine to conduct. All enemies. Let's try this. I pray you're ready. And I do want to attack the other two from behind. Smooth finish. Great work, everyone. <laughs> Some of them yet remain. Tread lightly. <laughs> All right, we did it! Oh, can I not attack them from behind? Oh, that's so sad. I really wanted it. It's okay. <sighs> what? Okay, who set up this? <laughs> Whose idea was this place? Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Friends, frostbite. Are they gonna be icing us? All right, yeah, let's push through. Huh? Any use for that? Uh, uh, Ow! Incoming. <laughs> <laughs> Cold. 
I don't know if I can heal you. Frozen. I won't hold back! Your attacks won't do much like Fire. this! Fire! You hit their weakness! I'm That's cold. your own thing, Captain! Please! That helped. I will the fix battlefield that frozen down. real quick. What a finale! Keep your energy up, everyone! So, like, how do we do maintenance on the I'm chandelier? Sorry, well, you see. This frost is sapping my... well, you see. You see. You have to, like, jump down ten different areas real quick. Yeah, okay, we're good there. Come on! I knew I was I count on you. No, no. No, no, no. Nice. Oh, you've done it. Diamond. Can we clap there? Thank you. That should come in handy. Pocket it. What do you think Hi. you'll do? Up for excuse for intruders, you wander up to us. Never thought I'd see the day. <laughs> like my real magic. Um, uh, Ask Doe is still appreciated us. We'll, we'll still appreciate us bringing him in alive. Seems like no choice, but we're not lures. Let's go! Burn! You hit their weakness! Oh, That's your opening, summoner. Captain! Oh, I see. Come forth now! This is the last! We're counting on you, Yufa. And you got ice? Ice! Oh. Hot. Here I go! Hot. No, not if I can get close. It is over. Physical? Let's okay. Do this. I hit their weakness. I won't lose. I won't hold back! Oh. I'm pretty sure my physical currently is ice, so we're just gonna. This is That was perfect. We shall sweep them. Let's go, Every guys. Turn. What is it? It's okay. I wanted the loot. All right. <laughs> Opera cape. Does that help you at all? What now? It Sounds does. like a lovely time. Nice. Let's head on the up no. and up. No. Great find. Keep it. All right, I, I, I do have... I have a lot of questions for who designed this place. What... Let's do this. Let's okay. do this. Stay sharp. Everyone. Burn. You hit their weakness. I pray That's you're your ready. Opening, Captain. It is your turn. This you is the end. One. We're counting That's on you. That's how you do it. By this power. Let's go, guys. What a finale. Keep your energy up, everyone. Coming vigilant. There's still enemies about. Marvelous. Let's do it. Hi, what's kind of shiny over here? Hi, where'd you come from? Did you feed the guards below? Good. I have time, let us through. Take now one step further. Doctors among armies to be respected. Uh, as a candidate, it was shielded by the royal magic. We can make short work of them. We've not. Uh, we can't fall here. I won't hold back. Burn. Oh, no. most in here. Here I go. Opening, Captain. To go to his side. Come forth now. A bit more to go. We're counting on you. Let's stay calm. Oh, you are weak to this. Yeah. <laughs> It's too early. I pray you're ready. Go to his side. Uh, we're going to his side. 
I I'm capable too. Excellent heathens! <laughs> Trivial. I won't lose. Charging in. Hey, bro. You hit their weakness. You disgrace the sanctus. It is over. I will hit their weakness. Let's do this. No, my miss. Take this. <laughs> Come at me. I saw something we somewhere, guys. People we'll say that missing must be like really annoying in this game. I don't like that you miss it every game. Expose it is over. This can't be. Close your head. Insolent heathens! <sighs> Trivial. I won't lose. We shall sweep them! <sighs> Perfect. Together guards, let's head for the roof. I need to heal her. Oh no. That is the least well, amount of clothing we've ever seen him wear. Now this is unbelievable. Sanctifex Forden's relic appears to be a colossal chalice. I'm told it's believed to be an ancient artifact called a Holy Grail. Truly, a relic to put all others to shame. The pagans looted this from the church's vaults in antiquity. God, in his omniscience, is said to have imbued it with his essence giving it the power to make wishes come true. And how did such a glorious relic come into your hands? We simply preached his holy works and spread the teachings. It's just the Mutual Holy Grail, you know how it be. Sometimes day. you casually just have to show up with the Holy Grail. Through guided prayer, anyone can be saved. And we may see God's blessing in all things. Just incredible. I still it, say we should let Luis kill Forden before I we even try to attack him. So it is. I suppose that marks his eminence Forden as the sole winner. Even to an amateur's eye, no other relic could compete. Ladies and gentlemen, a big round of applause for Sanctifex Forden. Now, continuing on. Wait, Forden was last to present? That's not right. We've not seen Luis yet, or the island team. Is there an issue? No. I think we're finally having a show end without incident. Oh, After they really all, know. These were originally Sanctus relics anyway. <clears throat> well, uh, it looks like that's all the divine relics our candidates found across the land. The top-ranking faces will be announced during tomorrow's festivities. And now, it is my distinct honor to present a one-act opera for a Saint's Eve to remember. Please, join me in welcoming the diva herself, Juna, for a performance of the opera's opening piece. Ladies and gents, enjoy! It's time! Well, Louise, rumor has it you found yourself quite a relic. Then why are you so reluctant to present it? <laughs> no matter. The race's outcome is beyond your meddling now. Victory is mine. Bro should kill him right now. I literally like Luis more than that, dude. <laughs> <sighs> Made it to the roof for some time. Let's hurry. Uh, we can get down to the chandelier from that building. Hurry. Finally. Hold what on. now? Okay. Let's go, guys. Oh, this way? I got you. It's leg day. Need any other loot? I guess not. Alright. We're here. 
I think we can get down onto that massive chandelier hanging from the ceiling. Our escape route is secure. Oh, let's go. We the crew's here. Flee undetected. Good. Everything's going according to plan so far, but time's running out. From here on, it's all up to him. All will be fine. Okay. It's finally time to end this. Ain't no way. <laughs> Ain't no way. Juna's song is about to start. From my fingertip flies a butterfly. How it pines for the moon up high. Fire calls its name, fly to the flame. Burning as free as it can be. <laughs> Out there, deep and dark in the valley mist. Focus. You I only get one shot at this. <laughs> I would miss. <laughs> I would miss. I can't close my eyes to the sun My guy here is going to have a panic attack. Now! We got him! Right? Hey! The Lance! Hurry! <laughs> Yeah, he got it, right? What's going on? He knew about the plan. Is there something blocking it? Ladies and gentlemen, what an honor! That was our kingdom's lovely songstress, Juna. Moving right along. Okay. Um, it didn't work. Come back. Hail! Is it done? Well, I should have hit him, but we can't get Taking it back. Into account. Some sort of interference. Luce is doing no doubt. Well, it struck true, yes. Is he slain or not? Oh, uh, we can't be true. sure. It was certainly dark, and Slance hasn't returned. We can't make a clear judgment. Now, you just think about it now. We have done all that we can. Hey! For that moment, at least. Uh, for the moment, at least. Let's get out of here. The longer we stick around, the worse it'll be. Bro is certainly gonna come for us. Why do you dawdle? Did you get him? We do not know why, but the lance. Should we withdraw to retrieve it? Or make our escape? <sighs> Lost a lance? Perhaps it's this one. At last your allegiance is laid bare. And if this lance wounded me, then I take it the one you provided me was a mere imitation. If you know what the lance is capable of, then surely you understand the situation. Your last hope is gone. No! It seems a shame to kill you, but I'm afraid you've gone too far. I have no intention of surrendering, nor of wavering in my convictions. How do you put all the armor on in that, in that time period? <laughs> Bro put on a lot of clothes! That being said, 
You truly have impressed me. I will allow you some final words, if you have any. <laughs> Say it! I see your performance has come to an end, Juna. Yes, the curtain falls. I'm no longer your songbird to keep caged. <laughs> so, you too stood with them. Come on! He's ready to listen, so say it! You know there's something he needs to hear. <sighs> Juna is staring fiercely, pro uh, prompting my words. Lance has fallen to Lisa's hands, who can no longer have the means to counter his attack. There's still hope. Um, if we're this close, there's one thing I can say. Shandy to a duel. Luis, I challenge you to a duel. Ah, the very words I was waiting for. You really have done your research. He's so tall compared to... <laughs> In truth, I intended from the start to entertain such a challenge. I confess it's been a long time. Perhaps a real contest is what I've craved. This competition is little more than child's play. So be it. It has been a long time indeed since anyone drew my blood. I will end your life with my own hands. Then it's to be a direct confrontation after all. As though it was fate all along. A duel makes the king's magic powerless, which means this trinket is no longer necessary. Then state your name! How do you declare yourself? You'll say the country, Trump from evil, the king in your stead. State the country. I am the hero, the savior of this country. You would save it, would you? I hope that dream does not end in futility. My name is Luis Guirburn. I am the rightful king, he who will forge anew this unworthy country into a utopia. Attack in any number, wield any weapons, but fight with your very lives. If you live by a creed, show me its strength. I was on Twitch and, and I was like watching someone and this ad came up and it was that exact scene and I'm like, I didn't want to see it though. How dare. Um... I want to rob him, though. <laughs> That's my main priority at, like, all times in this game. I want to rob them. Go ahead. Have at me. An attempt on the life of Louis Squeerburn is a folly most cannot afford. You know, Louis can't fight full strength after that direct lance wound. We've come this far. Let's fight with all we have, Captain. Your time to end here. Luis, I will make an end of you here! I should expect no less by a duel's code. So be it. Allow me to even the score. This is our mission. We'll oh, see justice power done. of kings! Now. I'll take this. You you your like your He's you not holding anything! All right, all right. I shall vanquish evil. No, not this. After me! Let's go! This is it! I'm ready for him to resist this, though. I oh, know, okay. It's okay. General! Everyone, oh, you back! Bear witness! I strike to kill! Oh, please! Okay. Summoner! Maybe I'll fire. It is your turn! I'm assuming he's gotta have a weakness, right? You need to go back. Rancor! Now, what's the play? No holding back! The power of lightning! This may be your only chance. It won't hold me. back! Remarkable! 
That was Even perfect. my strength will be needed. Here I go. Come forth now. <sighs> no attack fell is always nice. This is strength. <laughs> I strike to kill. <laughs> I strike um, this is definitely not the last fight with him, and I wouldn't be surprised if he also had another phase, because he's really weak. Alright, now you gotta leave, bro. I'm counting on you! face, Hulkenberg! To the fore! Samurai! What am I stepping back, Samurai? Can you get poison, sir? Pierce! I will fight with pride. Oh, Let's go. Turn. Ah. You I hesitate. pray you're ready. What's wrong? You hesitate, this may bro. Be your oh, only power chance of to kill heroes. Me. As the point of a sword. Bear witness. Oh. I strike to kill! Surely there would be another I phase in anything. Nah. Uh, if the main boss of a game in anything, not even as RPGs, they wouldn't make you fight them multiple times, right? <laughs> no, no. What are my options? I call upon royal power within! <laughs> Interesting. We can do this. That was helpful. Helpful as ever. I'm obliged. This is Summoner. It Lower is that attack. The enemy still stands. Dark Knight. Interesting. Pierce, worthy foe after all. This is strength. I strike to kill. I strike to kill. I strike to kill. I'm glad we're not the um healer class currently, because I actually believe they're weak to that type of damage. Let's try this. Thanks. It's okay. General! <laughs> A tough one. Take my fullest power. You know that. You know. Help me finish this. Come! As the still standing, I see. Bear witness! I'm bearing witness, sir. <laughs> Only a flesh wound. I strike to kill. No. Come. It's okay. Accept my, my challenge. Strength is fading. I strike to kill. Stroll. Stroll. It's Juno's turn. They got you with multiple ailments. Let's trade Taking places. Taking center stage. Uh, by this power. Thing. Uh, Still here? Oh, souls of kings. Lower that attack. Give me strength. Uh, Dark Knight. Interesting. I'll run the worthy foe after all. Mask dancer. Yeah. Burn. Let's go. I underestimated you. That's a lot of money, good sir. Satisfactory. A lot of experience, too. Nice. I'll strive for greater heights. Let's all go into magic. Nice. I feel stronger already. Guys, his agility is 29. He didn't miss in that fight, but he misses so frequently. And I'm so confused. Ha! <laughs> I have never known such heights. Even I had more to learn. Tremble before me. Does it Let's seem go. that I've grown stronger? Lord Luis, do not interfere. You falter even now. Oh, we're gonna stab him in the back. Not enough, I'm afraid. Uh, 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 
Lord Luis! A fine blow. You've surprised me. But why? Why are you so intent on killing me? Are we going to talk about the prince? You of all people should know the answer. I see now. You were the intruders looking for the formula, I take it. And yet, you have achieved nothing. What do you mean? Oh. Oh no. Fall damage. Thank you, bro. Bleeds a lot. <laughs> Ooh. Did we do it? Lord Louise? At long last, tis done. We have brought him to justice. The great, untouchable no. traitor. I don't think so. Louise Guillaubin is dead. Apologies. Things fell apart at the end, and I wasn't thinking straight. Even so, the outcome is the same. We could not have triumphed without everyone here. Wait! It's good that we got him and all, but the lance... Ah, uh, yes! It went down with him! This looks dire. He's fallen in the middle of the stage. If Forden spies Luis's body run through with the lance, He'll realize its power in an instant. Yeah, we Even gotta kill Forden. We the prince, we'll regret it if Forden ends up with the lance. Yufa, can you call it up? No, too late for that. It's already in the middle of the crowd. If we call it up and take it with no explanation, everyone will think us thieves. Then what do you propose? First, we need to establish that the lance is ours. Our offering for the ceremony. We'll have to take the stage and announce that ourselves. Please, wait. Do we reveal that we are the ones who slew Luis? Can we afford to declare that openly? We'd be telling your supporters you deceived them and your master both. She's right. The audience has no idea what's going on. We'll just look like the bad guys. It's okay. We set out to kill Luis. I do find it interesting. Done. Our only failure is in the spectacle we made of it. That Luis definitely recognized Hulkenberg, like, like he knew that she was there. That's how he's able to piece, like, able to piece together. For now, we need to think of a way to get the audience to see our side. You want to win their sympathy? What are you even planning to say? That Luis was going to kill Forded with that? I don't know. <sighs> but we have to get on stage now. If we don't explain ourselves fast, we'll never get a chance to. What? Wait a minute. I know that face. Was that Louise? Someone go and see to him. Is he truly dead? Allow me. Lord Louise, no. The prince? He's dead. He's gone. Your eminence, this was found off stage. Judging by his wounds, this must have been the murder weapon. The lance? Is this the divine relic he sent his subordinates after? His eyes are sightless. His heart beats no more. The man is dead, without question. I can always think it would be the prince. You're absolutely certain. I checked him thrice over. There can be no more doubt. But also... I cannot just do five voices at all, so I'm going to hear that. Mm. Luis! Dead! 
And that can only mean this lance can pierce the barrier of the king's. King's magic, sorry. I apologize for the grotesque display interrupting tonight's performance. We are tardy in arrival, but the lance you hold is our offering to the ceremony. What? You claim this lance? You mean to say you were the ones who did the deed? Hey, bro. Yes. It is as you say. God above! How do you justify this? Years ago, Luis ordered my hometown destroyed. Hulkenberg, our ally before you, was herself a royal guard in service to his late highness. Even the songstress, Juna, aided us on several occasions. Above all else, we are a group who came together to try Luis for his crimes. Traitor and Kingslayer both. And to do that, we had to enter his company. We took no joy in disguising our true intentions, not from your eminence, nor the people. But today, finally, we have seen justice done. Luis has paid for his sins. And at last, at long last, my parents can rest in peace. I had not realized you were such an actor. <sighs> or do you truly weep? It's just hitting me now. No, no. We finally won. No, no. No, no, everyone. Let's have a little composure. I like how the two of them are walking off stage. That explains why the songstress was so often with Luis, as well as these brave misfits. I understand. It all makes sense now. I had wondered why a member of the Prince's own guard would fall in with Luis. You have done well to execute the rebel. I am sure that His Late Majesty and His Highness must be pleased. And of course, the Sanctus Church recognizes your divine relic. Now we shall greet tomorrow's festivities with fresh peace in our hearts. Thank you, Your Eminence. You must be the Lady Hulkenberg. The day His Highness was attacked, I heard you fought harder than any other. Your blade even struck the back of the blackguard who did it. Of all his defenders, you came closest to avenging the prince. But where you faltered then, you triumph today. All right, let's kill him. <laughs> I'm ready. You are a true knight. <sighs> Is something the matter? Oh, no. You honor me greatly, your eminence. Now, this lance. The Sanctus Church will confiscate it for now. A lance capable of killing the tournament's candidates would only sow panic and chaos. Should you not be able to have it then? Yes. As you wish. We brought it as an offering anyway. Indeed. You may step down now. Think you can just walk away, do ya? You owe us a moment or three. Hey guys. Five. Right. Yes. Fine, if you have my arch nemesis, Luis, this should break the prince's curse. So you lot were working against us from the start. And you right along with them, Lady Juna. What was your motive? Why did you kill Lord Luis? If this was truly a matter of justice and not simply petty revenge, then we owe it to them to explain why we have taken their guiding force. They deserve that much. Captain, do you not agree? Oh, yeah. It's time for the truth. All right. It's time for the truth. I am sorry if I'm overstepping my mark. I know I'm but the latest to become your ally, but... No, you speak the truth. We have sought to save the rightful heir to the throne to break the curse afflicting His Highness the Prince. What's that? The Prince? He's dead, mate. Wait, he is dead, isn't he? He's dead, all right. 
You lot will need a better story than that if you don't want to get cut open where you stand. He had to be declared dead in order to protect him. Though he lives, he is bedridden, cursed by magic. And the only way left to undo that curse? But it didn't work. Was to kill Luis. Those of us who wanted the prince restored formed a secret faction. And I was a spy in its service. Trying to find out if we had any option beyond murder. <sighs> I cannot expect you to understand all this immediately. However... You did this for the prince! His father, the king, was a coward! Puppet of Forden! It was because of him that this country rotted from the inside. And for his son! For his bloody, useless corpse of a son! What made you think his life was worth more than Count Luis? Worth more? I thought you two hated when people tell you any life weighs more than another. I myself have never met His Highness, nor do I know what sort of person he is. But I want to see the future these people believe in. Despite our many differences of tribe and status, we still banded together. Through them, I saw the possibility of a world united. Besides, when Luis talked about burning down my island, I thought I saw the shock and despair on your faces too. Look, you two. Was Luis really a master worth your trust? I think it's worth listening to your hearts now. Even the doubts. I know we'd be happy to have you. Hold a moment. These two no, no, are Luis's right come with hand us. Men. I would advise against this. No. No, I love them. Their hearts are as loyal as any of ours. <laughs> no, I love them. They both served another master. Lady Juna. Uh, I guess you really were watching out for us. More than we ever knew. I couldn't protect Basilio when it mattered most. They put him through so much for their sodden igniter experiments, and I'm now protecting him's all I've got. Del. Maybe it is time to step back. Get away from this bloody business. <laughs> I guess this was all it took. Count Luis gave us a dream to fight for, but I, I suppose it was the kind that doesn't feel right after you wake. So, we're drifters now. Maybe we'll open up that restaurant after all, eh? We'll see you around, Lady Juna. Look, I... I'm not the smart one, you lot know that, so I don't know whether to punch you or thank you. I've never been this confused in all my life. Damn it, I just don't get it. Damn it! Oh, Del, wait! Don't you wander off like that? You mean all that about the restaurant, yeah? <laughs> time for restaurant never time. I could say what you were feeling. I'm sorry this was all I could do. Ah, Captain, let us tarry no more. We must check His Highness's condition. Yes, you're right! That should have lifted the curse! What? What's going on? The cursed thorns haven't disappeared! But the caster is dead! Forden and his guard were sure to check Luis's body! Calm down, everyone. We don't want to yell about this in public. Let's go back to the inn for now. Hmm. And we can't break about the formula. His Highness still suffers under the curse. But Luis is dead. I cannot fathom it. Maybe we killed a fake. Like his body double. Or something. No. There's no way that wasn't Luis. We couldn't fight him in person and still be mistaken. And Luis would have nothing to gain from faking his death, surely. After all, it put the lance in Forden's hands. Knowing all that, might the curse have been cast by someone else entirely? But that would mean we killed an innocent person, wouldn't it? Bro's not innocent. <laughs> but bro's not innocent. But continue. That bastard was no innocent. <laughs> yeah. He destroyed my home. He murdered the king. And true enough, old boy. But that's not why we were out to kill the chap, right? He said it himself, that killing him accomplished nothing. 
Was it really true? Yet he had the formula for the curse in his possession. Surely that marks his guilt? Even so, there remains a modicum of doubt in the matter. Perhaps Luis was researching the curse for another reason. If he was framed, it is possible he aimed to clear his name. <sighs> when she saw the formula, Rella did say it was an outline, likely jotted from memory. So that means the formula wasn't a formula to begin with, just at least a scratch where it proved that he was looking way to prove his innocence. Well, he didn't want to prove his innocence. He didn't but care. But if it wasn't Luis, who else could have... That night, His Highness the Prince was already fleeing when I arrived at the scene. I encountered the assailant as I sought to protect His Highness. I pursued and slashed across their back. Right. I remember Forden mentioned something about that. Is there anything else you can remember? Fie! No, I can recall nothing else! No other clues! Everyone we meet would tell them to take off their shirts. Yet... No, tis odd. I believe this is the first time I have recounted the particulars to anyone. I told the investigators only that I failed to capture the culprit. The shame of my failure kept me silent on the rest. And What? Forden knew it. But just earlier, Forden said... Yes, he told a story that none but the culprit could attest to. How does Forden know? Mm, he's behind all of this. Could Forden be the one behind all of this? Oh, I have no evidence to say otherwise. You, you do realize he's the sanct effect of the entire dashed sanctity. It's okay. Church. We were gonna kill everyone in church yeah, but anyway. But that does not make it impossible. In game. It wasn't long after the prince's passing that His Majesty named sanctism the state religion. If not for the matter concerning the king's magic, Forden's claim to the throne would have been unshakable. Sounds like motive enough to want the prince gone. We have to find out, even if it's remotely possible. Let's question Forden in person at the main festival tomorrow. <laughs> Take we'll off your shirt. Divine lance back too. It's not something we want in Forden's hands, especially now. Hey, I'm going to go talk to my sister. She's bound to be somewhere in the city for the Saints' Day festivities. <sighs> At the local tavern. Um, sister, I should explain. All that fuss today was... Well... Is it safe for you to come to such a public place? What? No, it's fine. It's not like we caused a riot or anything. We even explained ourselves um, to Forden's satisfaction. No, uh, no, Actually, not that. That's not what I meant. You're the songstress, remember? Ah, uh, yes. Suppose you're right. I know we talked before about the loophole in the King's protective magic, but I never thought you would be the one to strike Luis down. And that lance you presented... I take it that's why you went to Virga Island. We didn't mean for it to be such a spectacle. It didn't exactly go according to plan. But at least we kept a tyrant off the throne. And that's why I was wondering if I could ask you something. About Sanctifex Forden. What kind of man he really is. Because, well, now that Luis is out of the picture, we know who's got the best chance. A man as powerful as him. Well, you know how it is. You hear all kinds of nasty rumors swirling about. I'm just wondering if there's any truth to them. Tuna, I... Are you seriously trying to dig up dirt on Santifex Forden? Oh, it's the best day. day of all days. Best day. Oh, loosen up a bit. You can't deny that people talk, and God knows they always have. Especially about the night of the attack. Asking how anyone could sneak into the castle, let alone get to the prince. Whether some official ordered the assassination. Remember when those rumors started? Father was on edge for days. I remember even when I hadn't said anything, he'd scold me and send me away. I don't suppose... you ever heard if there was any truth to that. <sighs> <sighs> Sorry. I don't mean to dance around it so... It's just not an easy thing to ask about. I was talking with one of our allies, Hulkenberg. She said Forden mentioned something he couldn't have known, unless he was actually there, the night of the attack. Unlikely as it is, 
If it turns out Forden was involved, she won't suffer him being crowned. She'll be out for vengeance. And you're the eldest daughter of House Cygnus, a Sanctist family. The people would see you as an accomplice to a man who had a hand in killing the royals. I couldn't bear to let that happen. You don't deserve that. I need to know the truth. Then, suppose His Eminence Forden were guilty of such sin. What would you do with him? With the Sanctus Church? What do you mean? Well, I was but a girl of only 12 I really years. Stab them with I that knew nothing lance. about the inner workings of the Crown Theocracy. <sighs> Sister, what's wrong? Nothing. <laughs> I'm fine. If a tad overworked, all these new developments and tragic events, I'm, I'm just run a little ragged, that's all. Sister, I'll be fine. Really? I'm sorry you had to see me like that. If I am to be the people's saint, I must be strong enough to play the part. Maybe I'll hold off on the harder drinks today, just to be safe. It's been a long time since we could spend some simple time together like this. It's like we're just two sisters visiting Montario for the holiday. I'll see you again soon. I was thinking we might be able to save for a bit. Um, seems Juno wasn't able to get much from Rella. Rella won't talk. We have no choice but to pry the truth out of the forge tomorrow. Rest. I'm sure you've got lots in your mind, but I can tell that you're tired. Let's rest up and get ready for tomorrow. That's Luis. Luis is by no means an innocent man, but we've killed someone we shouldn't have. It's not so much that I'm feeling guilty, but I have a sense of foreboding. I hope it's my imagination. No, it's not. <sighs> Forden that her. I long believed the church was not as pristine as it presented it, but if it truly was the man behind the attack, we must proclaim the spear swiftly. <sighs> we finally taken down our greatest foe, yet it seems we can't celebrate, celebrate just yet. I was naive to think that taking down Luis would solve our problems. <laughs> Forden truly have killed his highness if the attack was by his hand, though we must have our answers from him, no matter that by the means. Tree culprit behind the curse must be brought to justice. His size his life is at stake. He wants in this room? Hey. <laughs> the murder of Louise. The princess curse is unbroken. We went through so much to get here. I can't feel, feel conflicted. To make matters worse, Rella seems to be hiding something. She's never been a good liar. And a little save, guys, because we're going to leave it here on this cliff and we're going to go confront Forden tomorrow, both in game and real life too we're gonna have a full day of this uh thank you guys so much for hanging out and for resident Evil five earlier and uh metaphor right now for the past uh two and a half hours about i appreciate you it's been a ton of fun guys and again happy halloween the the second and to the third it, all of november is halloween guys so we'll definitely play more horror games as well but thank you guys again for hanging out here well uh sleep town in game and we can start off next time and then go confront Forden. Because it makes so much sense that Forden is a baddie because he is absolute trash and he has never done anything to slightly suggest otherwise. And it kind of seemed like Louis just like reading the book that we read and he was like, I want this world, but by killing everyone who doesn't want it. <laughs> so basically he had like the same goals as us. Just in really bad ways. I'm gonna see if he goes on to raid, and I'm gonna leave it here. Thank you guys, thanks so much for hanging out. I appreciate you. I hope you guys have a great weekend.